Mr. Speaker, President Trump's irresponsible shutdown is in its 19th day. America's working families are bearing the brunt. In Illinois alone, more than 7,000 federal workers are going without pay. Without a solution, more Americans and our nation's economy will suffer. Tax refunds that families depend on could be frozen or delayed. Nutrition assistance programs could be reduced. The Northern Illinois Food Bank is now dipping into reserves to operate without USDA funding. Air travelers already experiencing longer lines as TA, TSA struggles to staff checkpoints with workers who aren't being paid will incur even longer delays. None of this is necessary. Last week, this new Congress passed bipartisan bills to fully reopen our government. This week, we will pass them again, department by department. The President needs to stop holding our federal agencies and the livelihoods of thousands of families hostage. The Senate needs to take yes for an answer and vote to open the government now. Then we can continue the debate on how best to secure our border. And with that, I yield back. For